Kelowna Weather brought to you by Border Plumbing, Heating, and Electrical. Good afternoon, Kelowna. Sarah Jones here to give you a look at what's going on around Kelowna this weekend. Well, the rain don't stop coming and it don't stop coming and it don't stop coming and it don't stop coming and they don't stop coming and they don't stop coming and they don't But luckily, the rain looks like it might hold off this weekend. While we did see a thunderstorm below through this morning, clouds are anticipated to stick around for most of the afternoon as we get up to a high of 20 degrees. There is a 30% chance of showers predicted for tonight, but fingers crossed, it stays away. On Saturday, Environment Canada predicts a high of 18 with a mix of sun and cloud, becoming more cloudy in the afternoon as it drops to a low of 9. And on Sunday, clouds will linger in the valley as we see a high of 19 degrees. Looking for events this weekend? Don't even worry because we got you covered here at Kelowna Now. On Saturday, you can head on down to the Oyama Zipline Adventure Park as they're hosting Wounded Warriors Day, a family-friendly fundraising event to support Wounded Warriors Canada on May 28th. Families can tour emergency vehicles, meet veterans, enjoy park activities, enjoy barbecue lunch, and take part in the festive atmosphere with various vendors in the Lakeview Park setting for a free all-day event. On Saturday and Sunday, join six professional artists for some live musical entertainment, refreshments, and incredible artwork at the first annual Warehouse Art Event in Kelowna. Head on over to Hannington Painting from 10 to 5. Over 70 original artwork is on display. Pieces of artwork on display. The Kelowna Car and Bike Show returns to Rutland Lines Park this Saturday and Sunday from 11 a.m. to 4 p.m. Check out a variety of classic, fast, foreign, or domestic vehicles on top of cars and bikes. You can treat yourself to a day of free live entertainment, local vendors, and food. On Sunday, the British Columbia Dragoons will hold a change of command ceremony at the Cenotaph in City Park. The Dragoons will depart regi their regiment headquarters at 720 Lawrence Ave at 10.30 a.m. and march downtown so people should anticipate some rolling closures along Lawrence and Leon on May 20th between 10.30 and noon. Alrighty, Kelowna, that's it. That's all. For more information on events, breaking news, and weather, check out Kelowna Now's website or follow the socials on Facebook, Instagram, TikTok, and Twitter. I'll be back on Monday for another look at your weekly weather update. Enjoy your weekend, Kelowna, and I'll see you around. This weekend's weather and events update was brought to you by Border Plumbing, Heating, and Electrical with over 1,000 five-star reviews.